Hey YouTube, so what we have here is the Fire Phone, and it's uh, running CyanogenMod Mod 11. Um, it got ported over by a few guys, um, and uh, yeah, thanks to their hard work. Let me check who actually ported this so I can give somebody credit, because um, without, you know, their help, we wouldn't have this on um, the Fire Phone. Should be like contributors somewhere. Uh... Yeah, there we go. Contributors. I think the main guys in the middle. Yeah, it's Steve Kondike or Kondik. I don't know if I'm saying that right, but anyways. Um, so yeah, it works. Um, Google Now works. Um, what's cool about this is that, you know, you see it has the home button right here down at the bottom. Sorry. Um, and that still works as your home button. So if you want to go home, you can either use the on screen button or you can also use the uh, off screen button. So that's cool. Um, um, yeah, this is, uh, yeah, 4.4.4, .4 .4, so you don't get any of, like, the cool, you know, lollipop stuff. I mean, they didn't port that, because, I mean, it was probably a pain to, like, figure out how to port this. This is, uh, what I'm assuming. Um, and then, yeah, so this can also take photos, so I installed the Google Camera app, cause, and, um, yeah, you can take photos with it. And I'll swipe to the right. So yeah, this works. I've had one bug with the cam with the Google Camera app is that if you sh try to shoot in HDR with the Google Camera app, it will freeze on you. It just won't take the picture. So if I enabled HDR and I take the photo, oh, I mm, yeah. So it didn't save that photo. Yeah, didn't save that photo. Um, so yeah, let me try again, shoot the photo, yeah, see it's like totally broken, you have to like go in and, and close the app and then go back in and relaunch it and disable HDR, so that kind of doesn't work, I mean if you want to shoot in HDR super bad on this phone on CM, it's not going to work, I mean some people might ask like why the hell do you want to shoot in HDR, well it, um, basically takes a bunch of photos over three to five seconds and then it shoots them at different contrasts so you get a clearer crisper and more colorful picture because it's shooting at a higher range of contrasts and then kind of snipping them all together to get you a better photo um yeah so google chrome works uh, messenger works um you know phone app everything works so um yeah it's pretty cool and um i'm super excited um, and yeah, it's, uh, yeah, you got, we have CM now on, uh, fire, fi on the fire phone. So, uh, yeah, thanks to Steve and all the other guys who contributed to it. It's, um, pretty awesome. I mean, you look at this phone now, it's 179 on Amazon and, you know, you get a year of prime with that and now with CM on it as well, you know, if this ever gets CM 12. I mean, this is pretty hot. I mean, it has, uh, you know, 2 gigs of RAM, uh, 32 gigs, you know, 179. So, you know, you get a free year of Prime, which is 100 bucks by itself. This phone's basically 80 bucks plus tax by itself, making it about 100 bucks. So if you want a, two, a phone with 2 gigs of RAM and, and CM11 on it, it's pretty fast and uh, pretty quick. So I think it's pretty awesome value. Um, yeah, I mean, I'll just talk about the hardware in general on the Fire Phone. I mean, I kind of like it. It's got this uh, rubber on the sides. Kind of, you can grip the phone firmly in your hand. You don't have to worry about it slipping out of your hand. So that's pretty nice. And, um, yeah, that's it. And, um, yeah, I mean, the charging port, I guess, too, it's uh, pretty nice. It's pretty beefy, and, uh, you know, it's not going to break on you. So, all right, see ya.